What's going on, Master Duel fans? James here again. Uh, for the fusion side of things, deck profile for you guys throughout the whole entire uh, first half of the fusion slash link festival. And that fusion archetype of choice is Amazonas. Amazonas was slowly but surely one of my all time favorite decks as a kid growing up and i said to myself this deck of all decks it's literally a uh burning passion of a pet deck so let's go over the details of the amazonish strategies three princess heart and soul of the deck two baby tigers and then the one of spiritualist spy Swordswoman, Fighter, Paladin, Sage, Favorite, War Chief, and Queen. Now, the in depth of Amazonas Monsters. Big Queen, all Amazonas Monsters, self included, can't be killed by battle. War Chief, if you control no monsters or only Amazonist, free special from hand. Upon no more special, set one Amazonist spell trap or poly straight from the deck. And then you can only attack when Amazonist monsters. Sage, not once. At the end of the damage step, if this card attacked and is still alive on the field, target one spell trap your opponent controls, kill it. Paladin. Buffs up 100 attack for every Amazon as you control, only herself. Fighter, no battle damage involving fighter in battles. Swordswoman, your opponent takes the damage instead of you involving Swordswoman in battles. Spy, reveal one other Amazonist monster in your hand, free special to Spy. And then once per turn this way on a special, and then not once a turn, when this card gets killed by battle and sent to the graveyard, target one Amazonist monster in your graveyard that isn't spy, either put it back to the hand or shuffle it back. One spiritualist, if this card is in your hand or graveyard, target one Amazonist card you control that isn't spiritualist, return to the hand, and it can do special this card. And to turn into this, you cannot special from the extra deck except Amazonist monsters. So Spiritualist is your Amazonist version of what I like to call Blackwing Zephros the Elite. And then upon special summon, add one polymerization from deck to hand. And then each effect once. The two baby tigers. Its name is Amazonist Tiger while it's in the field or graveyard. If an Amazonist monster is no more special while this is in your hand or graveyard, free special once per turn this way on the uh, special. And then extra 100 attack for every Amazonist card, spell trap included, in your graveyard. Three Amazonist Princess. Again, the heart and soul. Her name is Amazonist Queen while it's on the field or graveyard. Upon no more special, add one Amazonist spell trap from deck to hand. And that search effect is once. The other effect is not once a turn. When this card declares an attack, send one other card from your hand or face up. Field to the graveyard, technically field to the graveyard. Special one Amazonist monster from your deck in defense that isn't Amazonist princess. 40 Amazonist spell traps. One spellcaster, village, fighting spirit, three calls, heart and soul of spell traps, three onslaughts, one willpower, one shamanism, and two secret arts. Spellcaster, target one Amazonist monster you control and one face up monster your opponent controls, switch the original attack of those targets until the end of the turn. Amazonist Village, all Amazonist monsters gain 200 attack. 
once per turn, when, not if, but when an Amazonist monster gets killed by battle or card effect and sent to the graveyard, special one Amazonist monster from your deck with a level less than or equal to that Amazonist monster in the graveyard. Amazonist Fighting Spirit. If your Amazonist monster attacks a monster with higher attack, the attacking monster gains a thousand attack during damage calculation only. Three Amazonist Call, the Heart and Soul. Take one Amazonist card that isn't Call and either add it to the hand or send it to the graveyard. During your main phase, banish this, target one Amazonist monster you control. No other monster you control can attack, but that targeted Amazonist can swing multiple monsters once each. Two Secret Arts. It's basically your fusion summon of Amazonist, of course. And then during your main phase, you can banish this once per turn. If you would perform a fusion summon of an Amazonist fusion monster this turn, you can also send one Amazonist monster from your extra deck to the graveyard as material. One effect per turn and only once that turn. So one effect or the other can't do both. One Shamanism. Destroy all Amazonist monsters you control. Then special summon level four or lower Amazonist monsters from your graveyard in face of defense up to the number of monsters destroyed by this effect. Amazonist Willpower. That is your call of the haunted of Amazonist. But the twist is it cannot change its body position and it must attack if able to. Three Amazonist Onslaughts. Once per turn, during the battle phase, doesn't matter whose battle phase, special summon one Amazonist monster from your hand, and if you do, extra 500 attack until the end of this turn, even if it leaves. After damage calculation, not once per turn, if your Amazonist monster battles a monster of theirs, while this card is already face up in your spell trap, does not target, does not destroy, I can banish my opponent's monster. And not once per turn, if this card on the field gets killed and sent to the graveyard, target one Amazonist monster in your graveyard, special it out. And then for the non-engine spells and traps, Lightning Storm, Triple Tactics Talent, just the one. Scapegoat, Link Climb. Two Book of Moons, two Forbidden Chalice, two Cosmic Cyclones, one blizzard blizzard came up clutch and then three infinite impermanence extra deck five amazonist fusion monsters not to mention one of them is a two of pet liger pet liger king empress and two augusta Pet Liger, one Tiger, and one Amazonist monster to make it. So your baby Tigers on the field with something else in terms of Amazonist name as material for Amazonist Pet Liger. And then Empress, one Amazonist Queen being the big queen or Amazonist Princess on the field for the Queen's namesake to make uh, Empress, the Pet Liger, once per battle, if it attacks during damage calc, extra 500 attack during that damage calculation only. If your Amazonist monster attacked an opponent's monster after damage calculation, target one face up monster your opponent controls, it loses 800 attack. It's not once a turn and it's perma loss. Monsters your opponent controls cannot attack. Amazonist monsters you control except this one. Both Pet Liger and Liger King literally share the same thing in terms of force to attack that monster only. Well, can only go after that monster. The twist is your opponent cannot attack Amazonist monsters while Liger King here cannot attack any monsters at all 
except Liger King himself. When it comes to Liger King, before we go any further with Empress Effect, target one Amazonist card you control and one Amazonist warrior in your graveyard, kill that card on the field, and if you do, special that other monster from your graveyard. It cannot attack the turn you use this effect. And that effect is once. Amazonist Empress. Other Amazonist cards you control cannot be killed by battle or card effects. If your Amazonist monsters, self included, attacks a defense monster pierced by the damage. If this face of fusion summon card gets killed by battle or leaves the field because of an opponent's card effect while its owner controls it, extra deck does not count about the return part. You can special one Amazonist Queen from your hand, deck, or graveyard. So, Big Queen from anywhere, or Princess from the graveyard specifically for the Queen's namesake. Amazonist Augusta, Amazonist Fusion, and Amazonist Tomaker. And this card came up at least like once or twice throughout the whole uh, Fusion side of the event. When it comes to Augusta, anti-target other Amazonist cards you control within card effects and they cannot be killed within card effects. If this card was fusion summoned by using Empress or Queen as material, it's a built-in Cyber Twin Dragon. And then first chance Augusta is fusion Shokun, special one Amazonist monster straight from your deck. So built-in e Telly upon fusion Shokun. And that effect is once. That's that for the archetype fusions. And then as for the links, Mrs. Radiant, this card comes up. Nightmare Phoenix, this comes up. Drumadol, card is insane. This card also definitely came up. And then Cross Sheep did not make this. Alsa didn't make this. Deco Talker also did not make it. Magnite Crusadia Avramax. That one I made once. It was versus Striker. Sky Strikers are tend to have a hard time dealing with Magnite Crusadia Avramax. But at the same time, there are uh, cards to answer in this format specifically. And then Unchained Abomination and Underworld Goddess, both of those never made once. And with that being said, this is James Polk on the fusion side of things with the archetype of Amazonist. Be sure to like, comment, subscribe, and share. And if you haven't already, smash the notification bell to keep yourself constantly updated. And we'll catch you guys next time.